MIT researchers have recently created cells programmed with synthetic analog gene circuits that are able to respond to a stimulus in a graded manner. A typical synthetic gene circuit is digital, meaning that it acts like a switch. Gene expression is either on or off. Analog gene circuits act more like dimmer switches and are capable of a broad range of outputs. Say that we wanted to make a cell that responded to the presence of a certain small molecule. A cell with a digital circuit would turn on expression of the output, in this case a fluorescent protein, in an all or nothing manner. In contrast, a cell with an analog circuit could respond dynamically to continuous concentrations of the small molecule, changing its output depending on the concentration of the small molecule. Here is a simplified view of how these circuits work. In the digital circuit, gene expression is turned on by transcription factors that bind to the small molecule. The digital circuit turns fully on at a threshold concentration of the small molecule. In the analog circuit, additional gene modules regulate the availability of the transcription factor based on the levels of the stimulus, allowing for a graded response. Analog circuits can carry out mathematical functions. To do addition, two circuits can be used, each of which respond to a different stimulus, but lead to the production of the same output molecule. Synthetic analog circuits are uniquely suited to interface engineered cells with a natural world where continuous information is predominant. For this reason, there are many potential medical applications for synthetic analog circuits. For example, we could engineer probiotic bacteria in the human microbiome to act as immune regulatory sentinels. When tissues become inflamed, the probiotic sentinels respond to pro-inflammatory molecules in a dynamic, graded way and provide just the right amount of anti-inflammatory medication when and where it's needed. These synthetic cell therapeutics are but one example of how synthetic analog circuits will enable cell-based precision medicine.